We are going to be demonstrating experiment 14.3 from our general science book. I would like to show you the supplies that you will be needing if you want to do this experiment with us. We have a two liter pop bottle that we have cut in half. We also, um, when we cut it in half, we found that we needed a knife to stick a little hole in it first before we could cut it with some strong scissors. You will also need some tape and a Ziploc bag that we have already taped to this half of the bottle. And you'll also need a balloon. Um, so as I said, we've already started doing this. So we have our two liter bottle that we've cut in half and we have um, taped the Ziploc bottle, excuse me, the Ziploc bag <laughs> to the bottom of the top half of the um, two liter bottle. And now what we are going to do is Tirza is going to blow up one of our balloons um, pretty large. <laughs> Keep blowing it up. I'm trying. I can't when I'm laughing. <laughs> Make it a little bigger. I know. I'm trying. I'm, every time I try, I keep laughing. which is kind of a fun thing to do because the only reason that we blew up the balloon was to stretch the balloon out, okay? So now that we have this, um, yeah. something like this, we are going to take the Ziploc yeah. bag and shove the slack inside uh, the bottle. So um, Tirza is going to put the balloon into the opening okay. on the top of the two liter bottle and then stretch the top around so that it will stay on like that. So now we are on step number yeah. nine. Um, if you look in your book, we are on page 360. We are on step number nine right here. And what it says is you now have a reasonable model yeah. of a lung. Yeah. To wash your lung breathe, yeah. pull the slack in the plastic bag down and watch the balloon. Then pull the slack up and watch the balloon. When you pull the slack in the plastic bag down, there is suddenly more room in the system. This allows the balloon to expand, and you should see it inflate a bit with air. When you push the slack back into the bottle, you get rid of the extra room, which squeezes the balloon, pushing the air out of it. So that is a pretty neat um, model of the lung that you should be able to do this experiment with at home easily um, access materials, so I hope that you do this experiment as well and that you enjoy doing it. Thank you. Have a good day.